Let's now begin with our top story this morning and terrifying scenes last night in Melbourne's northwest when a large gang went on a violent rampage throwing rocks at police cars and damaging property. Live now to today, Melbourne reporter Christina Hearn who's at the scene for us in Taylor's Hill. Chris, good morning. Tell us more. Was anyone injured? Well, Georgie, this all unfolded at 5.30 last night when a large group of African youths gathered here at this park in Taylor's Hill, reportedly intent on fighting. Uh, police responded. Now, that is when projectiles believed to be rocks were thrown and a police vehicle had its rear windscreen smashed. This was a large police response. It included officers from the public order response team, all dressed in riot gear. The air wing patrolled. Officers also blocked off streets. Residents say that they were told to stay inside and locked their doors as police battled to get this situation under control. Now, police say that the uh, that there were no injuries, no arrests, and the group dispersed quickly and that there was no threat to community safety. Neighbours, however, say that these two groups were warring groups intent on fighting. Some of them were still dressed in their school uniform. Police do say that they, are, they continue to work to address the community safety concerns here in Melbourne's West. Mm.